<sighs> Cheers, love! The cavalry's here! That was terrible. This is Mario Kart 8 Online Races. This is part 57. And that intro was suggested by Mario9919, who asked, in the next Mario Kart video, can you open up with, well, the line that everybody knows that Tracer says. Yeah. Very bad. Very, very bad uh, British accent by me. But, you know, I, I did it because it was requested. All right. So we're going to be finishing off those races, those slew of races that I started off with in the previous video. Uh, you know, we're going to be finishing off the, the same room, the same session, whatever that I was in. That's going to be finishing off with this very race here. It's going to be the last time! Am I going to be able to actually look good in front of these complete strangers on the internet? Let's see. Let's find out. As we race on through the good old Twisted Mansion, I feel like I haven't been here in a while. But then again, I haven't done one of these videos in a while, so I just, you know, it could be my, uh, my dementia acting up because, you know, I, I'm such an old man now at this point. Alrighty, so I'm behind the French Matthew, who is, uh, in no way related to the two Matthews that, uh, usually hang out with me on Discord, and, uh, I'm part of, you know, the old IR secret. But that's not important right now. What is important is the fact that I hit those guys with a bunch of fireballs. Okay? And then somehow avoided that piranha plant. So, go me. And also didn't get hit by that red shell. Oh, no, but I got hit by that one. So, alright. <laughs> hey, I returned the favor. Take that, papa -san. No, it looks like he had something to block that. Of course he did. Alright, so I'm going to get to a question. Uh, Queen Stodge asks, Will you be changing your name to playing with my Switch when the Nintendo Switch comes out? Again, these are, you know, kind of kind of old questions. Oh my god! That really just had that bob bomb bounced all over the place and landed, like, right in front of me. <laughs> That's not okay. Ooh, I remember that. I was just, I was sitting there like, oh no, am I going to have, like, at least a split second of time? Boom! No, no dodging involved here. Uh, so it, this was a... Uh, just just remember how badly I just cut through the end of the track there. That's uh, that's gonna be a recurring theme. Well, at least until the next, at least through the final lap here. Whee! Through the shortcut. So yeah, like I said, these questions are a little bit old here. Some of them are. Um, and uh, yeah, no, obviously I will not be. I think I mentioned that in the last stream that I did. Uh, where I said something along the lines of, you know, I had a name, and I liked it, and I didn't want to change it. So I'm sticking with it. Good old playing with Louie. PWMW. The greatest acronym in the history of acronyms. Alright. So we're finishing off here. Oh, I got an extra speed boost because that guy got hit by that boomerang. Now watch this here. I'm going to mushroom through here. And I literally, I just, I couldn't see. I, I just couldn't gauge where I was going and where I was. So I smacked right into that tree. It's, I don't know. It just, it all looked like fog in front of me. Huh. <sighs> That's probably my uh, my old eyes acting up, so, uh, you know, again, I'm old. Uh, okay, so, yeah, like I said, we're going to be moving on into a brand new session, brand new room with brand new people for brand new stuff and brand new fun. So, uh, yeah, you know, like I mentioned in the video description, or I think it was the, uh, no, I think it was the video description for uh, the, no, not the video, the, uh, like the Twitter Facebook post when I released the last video. I said, hey, people still play this game, you know. A reference to the fact that, you know, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe is out now, and, you know, people migrating over to the Switch, and a lot more people playing the Switch, so, you know, I just, uh, I was a little bit surprised myself, you know, to see that, to, you know, the game was still active, or, you know, at the very least that I could still find full rooms, or in this case, s mostly full rooms, so there you go. Uh, so yeah, here we are off to the Bowser, Neo Bowser City, which is... Legitimately one of my least favorite courses. I do not like this course. I don't like the water all over the place. It really messes me up. I just... I don't know. I don't know if it's just me or if it's the build that I have. But it just does not work for me. Don't like the stage. Nah. Not so much. Alrighty. So, uh... Let's go ahead and as I get hit by a red shell... Take Be Beatriz Ramirez's question. Who says, recent rumors... Again, this is an old question. Recent rumors have pointed to Super Mario Odyssey only having four worlds. Do you believe these rumors, and are you with or against Super Mario Odyssey having four worlds? Uh, I don't remember ever hearing that, aside from Beatrice's comment. Um, 
I'm, I'm trying to think. Like, if it only had four... I'm trying to think, like, maybe, like, a Super Mario Galaxy-esque map, you know? Like, you know, World 1, 2, 3, and 4. Um, if that was the case, I guess it wouldn't be that terrible. I mean, they could have, you know, packed more levels into each of the four worlds. But, uh, yeah, obviously that turned out to not be the case. There was a lot more kingdoms than that, and, uh, the game was absolutely super massive. No relation to the super massive galaxy, though. Uh, Stalia Lost City Plant asks, Will you do another Peach Cart 8 anytime soon? No, that was a one-off thing, just a special bonus video that I did, kind of like with Mario Kart Wii. Uh, you know, I did the Peach Cart Wii thing on Mario Kart Wii. Again, it was a reference to that, which is why I did the Peach Cart 8 thing. But, uh, yeah, no, that's, that was just a one-off thing for part 30. Uh, also, you know, oh my, hello. So, you know, I was kind of watching how I was driving, because I literally recorded this last night. I'm, I'm doing this commentary on Saturday night, I recorded this Friday night. Uh, and I remember thinking to myself that when I was drifting, it felt like I was holding the drift way longer than I should have. I don't know if, again, I don't know if that's just me or if it's because of the stage being like that. But yeah. Oh, that's right. I, I didn't, it didn't happen again this time because I got a golden mushroom, but... Yeah, the final turn there before the, the, the start of the final lap. I was holding the, the drift the entire time until I, like, boosted forward and then hit the little spinny, spinny, uh, pop-up thing. I don't know, it, it just felt like I was holding it for way too long, so I might have just been losing a lot of speed. Maybe, just, I don't know, I don't know. This, that stage just does not work for me. Speedy1997 asks, do you have a f uh, favorite Psychic-type Pokemon? Um... The, again, you know, I'm so bad with picking favorites. I don't like picking favorites. I like having multiple favorites or having multiple things that I like the best. Um, but I, you know, honestly, the first one that comes to mind is Espeon. Um, I, I probably have to go with Espeon. There are so many good psychic types. I, I love psychic types. Again, it's one of my favorite types. Um, I, I just, there's so many psychic types that I really, really love. I actually opened up like the uh, the psychic type page on Bulbapedia, and I was just like looking down the list. Um, God, you got like Mewtwo, you got Mew. Um, I, I like the uh, the Lake Trio, Deoxys, you know, Cresselia, uh, Mega Mewtwo, Y, because X is totally inferior. Uh, you know, Lugia, Gardevoir. You know, it's just I'm, I'm just kind of <clears throat> kind of going down this list, you know, little by little. But, uh, yeah. Oh, and also a little Raichu, which I feel like a lot of people just didn't like or didn't care for or didn't think was very good. But, man, I, I just, I love the, like, the thematic aspect of just, like, visually how uh, Alolan Raichu looks. It's literally, it's like a surfer dude. You know, it's surfing on its own tail and it's using its psychic powers to help itself float and, f and surf. You know, I think that's pretty cool. And, uh, you know, it looks great, and uh, I like the fact that it's it's a unique type combination, the only electric psych type in the game. But still, it's, uh, that's for another day, where I go on Pokemon rants or something. We're here in Wii Moo Moo Meadows, good old classic Mario Kart Wii stage, because, you know, Mario Kart Wii was the greatest, am I right? This was a little unfortunate here, with the, the blooper, I threw the red shell, or was this the unfortunate? Oh, no, never mind, it was it's, the next lap. Well, all spoilers. Uh, but yeah, I don't know if I actually hit the person in front of me with that red shell. Um, also, Mario9919 has the question, have you ever considered getting into the Shantae series? Um, I think I actually have the Pirate's Curse game. I think I have it on two different systems, actually. I, or I think I do. I can't remember. I know I have it on the Wii U. Somebody gave it to me. But, uh, I, I can't remember if I have it on like PC or 3DS or something. Oh, this, I think this was the unfortunate bit. Yeah, that was what happened. Right, I was so busy talking, I completely forgot. But luckily, I recorded this recently, so I remember. Um, I, what was that? I came right off the golden mushroom, and I zoomed right in between, a, a, right in a gap. Right between two item boxes, so I didn't get a, an item for the end of the race. And then I get hit by a red shell, because I didn't have anything to block it with. <clears throat> unfortunate. Um, but yeah, I haven't, I, I've never actually played them. Uh, I think somebody requested that I play the, the original Game Boy Color Shantae on a stream one time, and I don't know what was wrong with my emulator, but it was super, super laggy, 
and it was just like unplayable. But uh, yeah, I don't know. It, it seems like a kind of a tough series. You know, I see it at uh, Games Done Quick uh, marathons. Uh, you know, it looks like it's fun, but yeah, again, it looks like really challenging. So I don't know. Maybe. The answer is maybe. You know, I love to give really, really long-winded expla explanations for things that are just, you know, simple like yes or no or maybes. Uh, Flash Silver 88 has says, "Have you ever played Paper Mario Color Splash? If so, how did you how did you join enjoy it?" All right. <laughs> um, I didn't play that game, but I have heard good things about it. I heard that it was better than Sticker Star, which is promising. But uh, again, you know, when are they going to come back to the, uh, the the classic Paper Mario standard of you know having a bunch of partners with them? I miss that. Alright, so here we are at GBA Ribbon Road, and um, it's very ribbony, and it's a road. It's called a Ribbon Road. Also, I, you know, I, mm, I was kind of like, I wanted to say something about this race, but I probably shouldn't. Also, that's the bitty buggy right there. Probably shouldn't just spoil the race, you know, for everybody that's watching. But, uh, whoa, okay. Yeah, unfortunately, I tried to go for that shortcut early on there, the wavy blue ribbon portion. That was smart. You know, I saw that guy right next to me, I saw you had the super horn, and then I just, like, sat there staring blankly for a moment, like, oh no. Whoops. <laughs> and then he hit me with it. Also, that was really unfortunate. That guy zoomed in front of me, so I hit him with a red shell, and then his carcass, just sitting there, ate up the other two red shells that I had rotating around me. There goes that. It was basically, it was, it was like effectively like I had one red shell. Oh, okay. Hello, barely saving that one. Oh, I think this, oh my yeah, that was it. That was the really close shave there, where I was just falling off, and I just happened to use that mushroom boost to get me back straight onto the platform. Whee! And that happens again, where I just zoom right in between two item boxes. Unfortunate! But I really love the song. It's really, really funky. Whoa, that's a lot of fireballs. Um, the TC asks, have you played either of the Sega All-Star Racing games? No, I have not. Uh, oh, no, not again with the bomb bombs. Um, I don't really have any plans to. I, I just, I never was really interested in playing them. Um, but I have heard that there's a new one coming out. With, uh, uh, what was it? Oh god, I can't remember. Oh, I think it was just like a... Yeah, I think it was just like the standard like All-Stars racing format, you know, when they're, when they're, where they're all in carts. I remember seeing something about Shadow being in it, but uh, apparently from when I was looking up, apparently Shadow has already existed in the All-Star racing universe, so whatever. I thought it was like a surprise thing or something. Like, hey, here's everybody's favorite edgy character. It's Shadow. So I took an unfortunate six there. I could have, I could have, you know, I could have done that race so much better. That one, the last one, Moo Moo Meadows, and um, oh god, I can't remember what the race was before that already. Again, my brain is just going. But uh, yeah, I do remember that the Moo Moo Meadows and the uh, the Ribbon Road definitely stuck out in my mind after I was done recording as like two races that I really could have played a lot better, but just you know, I don't know. Could just be my skills deteriorating. Again, I barely play this game as it is. It's unfortunate. But I usually only just play this game just for the recordings. Uh, True Pixartron fan asks, Any games not announced slash confirmed for Switch that you want to see? Uh, not really. You know, I, I don't really have any expectations for games. Though there is one thing that I probably would have said, because again, I think this is kind of an older question. Um, there is something that I probably would have said if it had not been announced already was, of course, Smash, because who doesn't want to see more Smash? But again, you know, it's been, like, partially announced, you know, again, it, it seems like it's going to be a new Smash game, you know, it seems likely, but, uh, you know, again, I, I personally was a little bit nervous about it. Oh, that's cool, thank you for that. Uh, I was personally a little bit nervous about it because, again, I was aware of the Switches, you know, the whole deluxe, uh, theme thing that they're going with here, you know, like they got the, um, uh, uh, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, they got Pokken Tournament DX it's Deluxe, you know, it's basically like, you know, they're re-releasing Switch games, so, 
I personally would not be surprised if it was actually a re-release of, of Smash Bros. Wii U, just with new characters, which would be super, super unfortunate. Although, it doesn't seem like it's going to be that way, because again, they showed the Breath of the Wild link, and so that seems like it's leaning more towards it being a new game. Anyways, uh, let's take one more question. Uh, Adler Anderson asks, wouldn't it be cool if Nintendo announced a Mario Kart Mario Party hybrid game? No? I don't know how that would work. Like, what? I don't, I don't really understand that. I don't understand, like, how to combine those two. Like, I mean, I'm thinking, like, what was it, Mario Party 9, where they're all, you know, like, in the same, like, little car that moves around the map? That's not anything like Mario Kart. Also, this was super close! And in both of the fact that I almost got first, and the fact that I almost got hit by my own banana peel, or that guy's hell banana peel, those last two things would have been very unfortunate. Anyway, that's it for this video. If you like this video, why don't you subscribe, or check out some of my other videos. There's more on the way, so stay tuned. Don't forget to like this video. Ask me any questions you like. And, uh, yeah, you know, hit me up on Discord or, you know, or, or any of the other links that are, uh, provided for you in the video description below. Anyway, that's gonna be it. I'll see you all next time.